the Gale Shrine. Susano, start sleeping, my kid is soccer! What the? Oh, well, look at you, it's Susano again. Oh, spirit to the first one, saw it. I am closer than ever. Here at the Gale Shrine, where the beast makes his lair. You are true from Shrove, we're here. This conspiracy may bar my way, but if I pray long and hard, I shall eventually find a way in. The lazy bum's talking in his sleep. Well, that's just freaking great, isn't it? So, as we can see here, there's a barrier here, so let's go. Hey, what's this? What's with this guy? I can see right through him. Huh? Who are you? How is it you can see me? I am Yatsu, the earthbound spirit who haunts this area. How long has it been since have, since any have ventured this way? My eyes have failed me. I can no longer see. In their stead, my inner eye can judge a person's true form. You appear to be a maiden most fair. What could possibly bring you to the gay shrine? You must leave this place, for it is no longer a shrine of the gods. It is now cursed under the control of a horrible creature. This is no place for a fair maiden such as you. Fair maiden? He's talking about you, Furbo? That's the funniest thing I've ever heard, huh? <laughs> What's this? It appears a maiden is accompanied by a little booger. This is the village to meet its end at last. Little booger? He better not be talking about me. Hardly anyone has visited the Gale Shrine since it has been cursed. The strangely frenzied man over there is one of the few. He has been meditating alone at the shrine's entrance. But his sleep is filled with nightmares that make him cry out. I pity the poor man and would like to render what service I could, but when I try to peer into his dreams, an evil force bars my way. Who is the strange man? Come to think of it, Susano said something about being possessed. And he's been acting all weird since, like, the time he helped Kushi. What's this? I sense an intense power! It develops your body. Could it be this atomic power orbs? Fair maiden, the orbs would only choose the one who is our savior. The eight colors of light are living proof of that. Very well, you may pass, O oh savior of the Satomi house. Beware, fair maiden, Crimson Helm is a terrible fall. It is said that when the eight headed serpent was slain a hundred years ago, Crimson Helm emerged from a pool of the beast's blood. Never let your guard down. Wait, wait, wait! The store of the gay shop has opened! I must have finally communed with the guards! The time has come, foul spirit. Now I shall reveal your true form! Good luck with that. Well, let's let's go in. Into the gay shrine, the next dungeon. Starting off, we've got this room. Sure. Uh huh. Thanks. So, I guess let's check out this side area real quick first of all. Might be something in there. No, I don't know. Oh, well, Demon Gate. Let's take care of that. And a new enemy to boot. A uh, water something around. I don't know what you would call it, but it's certainly not good. Um, so we slash it open. I... I don't know what exactly we are supposed to do with this enemy. Just slash it, I guess? I mean, yeah, we could also do Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, power slash is still is for a fisher. And it drops two demon fangs! That's nice! Cool. But it has water elemental attacks, so, yeah. Defeating it gives us a key! So, I, I was ready to go in here. Nice. Let's take the key and head out. So... Now I guess we head to, through this another story gate. Down here. Where we find... Windmills that don't move. Okay. We can't really do anything about those, so let's keep going. Oh! Oh, well, it's another one of those key demons or lock demons. I still don't know what their official names are, but I don't really care anyways. 
A lot of feedbacks in here, that's nice. I gladly take those. And I guess now it's time for you to meet your end. Boom! <laughs> uh, that's always great. So, what we want to do here, this is an elevator. We place a ch cherry bomb in here and... Boom! We go higher. Ain't that nice. So, what's here? Oh, just a... Uh, Enemy scroll. And burning chest. We can't do anything about. I guess we can take care of the enemy scroll. Why not? Ah, not worth the water. I'm just gonna call it water ogres for now. I guess it's simpler to do. Ow. Okay, so yeah, if you hit them, they spew water. That's not good. Eh. So I guess power slash them to be safe? I don't know. There must, there must be some better tactic I'm missing, but whatever. Defeating him gives us a key. Cool. So we take the key, and we drop down again. And we place another... Place... Another... Place... Place... Another... Cherry bomb here. To go up. But, now we put another cherry bomb here to go up another level. It's an interesting design for an elevator, I gotta say. You get enough explosives to go up. Not the best design, but whatever. Over here is another lock demon. So, <coughs> boom. That boom was way too early, but whatever, I don't care. So, over here. Okay. Some more fire. That's not good. That could easily burn down the whole fucking thing here. Oh, whatever. Not my job. Let's go up. This whole view is very damp and depressing, I gotta say. Ugh. Well, I guess that's the, just the influence of evil power. So if you turn around here, there's a chest here. And it contains... A sun fragment, and now that we are free... Da -da -da. Another life piece. Nice. So now over here... We're on top of a giant windmill. Now that's one big windmill. I saw it down from the village, but I had no idea it was this big. Hey, what's that? Swelling around in front of the big windmill. It almost looks like wind, but it's black and foreboding. It's as if the wind were being forced in the opposite direction. I wonder if it's swirling evil air is what stopped the windmill. Maybe that's why the divine wind stopped blowing. If so, it must be the work of that crimson helm. What how we could get rid of the evil air? Right, reverse the direction. Oops. Sorry. And we restore to divine winds. All done. Now that the divine wind is back, I bet the big windmill will start to move again. Yes, yes, yes! Starting to spin. Look how strong the divine wind's blowing. Sure, I hope this drives away the evil down in the Pusa village. Huh? Now what? You should know the drill by now. It's another constellation.
Materasu, origin of all that is good that matter to us all. For too long I, Kazegami, god of wind, have walked a shadowed path. At last, light shines upon me, used my power to manipulate the wind. Banish those who would seek to shroud this world in darkness. Horses. I like horses. 